And so I go back just just recently. One of my patents was uh, was uh, was licensed to a company, and it was a spinoff of one of the things that I did on the shuttle. And and uh, the one of the flight surgeons came to me and said he had, he also serves in the Indianapolis 500 uh, race, and he said a lot of people are getting killed. Is there any, they're slamming into the concrete and, and they die. And he said, is there any way that we can actually prevent that? And so I, I thought of a, a, a energy absorbing net system that uh, that would actually catch the car and keep any any wheels or anything from flying out in the audience, and also uh, prevent the high uh, acceleration that the, the driver would experience. That, that would probably kill him. And so uh, I had we had patented that. He and I patented that, and just recently, last week. Uh, there was a licensing ceremony where they bought all the patent rights, and they'll be making it and, and testing it in, in uh, Colombia, and uh, and uh, probably get a lot of royalties from that. Where you have an intersection of two roads on on the, on the roadway, they 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 now put barrels and things like that, and it winds up killing the people. It doesn't absorb any energy. This they'll have they'll have this this system sitting there, and, and it looks like it's concrete, but it's not. When they hit it, it'll it'll just shatter apart, and this net will catch the car and stop it in a very slow, uh, low deceleration uh, rate, and uh, and and save the guy's life, so they won't die. And so they'll put them all around the country and probably the world after they uh, get it perfected. I'll have to. Uh, they want me to go down there and, and show them exactly how to do it and any little details that that they may not know.